We start at five with that breaking news in New Haven. Two people shot as gunfire breaks out in broad daylight. You were looking live at the scene. This is on Thompson Street. In, in the past 10 minutes, we did learn one person died here at this scene. Good evening, everybody. Thanks for joining us right now at 5. I'm Mark Zinni. And I'm Irene O'Connor. As Mark just mentioned, this is all playing out on Thompson Street in the city's New Hallville neighborhood. Pinpoint News Tracker shows us that is not too far from the downtown area. That's where we find Channel 3 New Haven Bureau Chief Matt McFarland. He joins us now live. Matt, what can you tell us? Well, Irene and Mark, as you just said, police confirming that this is now a deadly shooting, a 26-year-old dying from his injuries late this afternoon. I'm going to step out of the way so you can take a look at the scene here. You know, this is what uh, police have been dealing with. A large number of officers behind this crime tape. You can see police have been focusing most of their attention uh, on a number of evidence markers in the road and also by a car that's parked on the street. Now, not only do you have dozens of officers out here, it's also the first day of school here in New Haven, so you had buses trying to get through the neighborhood along with school kids trying to get back to their homes only to find this. Now, here's what we know. New Haven Police Chief Carl Jacobson tells us they got a call to Thompson Street just after one this afternoon for a report of shots fired. When they got here, officers found two victims. We're told both are from New Haven. Both are known to police. The chief says a 26-year-old was shot a number of times. He was rushed to the hospital in critical condition where he died from his injuries this afternoon. The second victim is a 20-year-old. We're told he was shot in the leg and is going to be okay. Now, pretty fluid situation out here with an active investigation but the chief adds that it appears the two were sitting in a car on Thompson when they were shot and that they were targeted. No words on a suspected shooter at the moment, but it's been quite the response from patrol officers, detectives, members of New Haven Shooting Task Force, to even inspectors from the state's attorney's office. And police have been throughout this neighborhood talking with those who live here, hoping someone could shed light into the early afternoon shooting. At this time, we believe they were the intended targets. Uh, but, of course, it's a bright, sunny day, first day of school, so we're very concerned about this, and we're going to do everything possible to um, make this street and the rest of New Haven safe. We have an active crime scene going on now. Detectives are working. If anybody has information, please call the New Haven Police Department. We cannot solve these things without the help of the community. And police expect to have an increased presence out here tonight as they continue to investigate what is now a deadly shooting here in New Haven. We're live with the Mobile Newsroom in New Haven. Matt McFarland, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.